So in this video, I'm going to speedrun the newest dimension with uh, two other really good players with a new strategy, basically. It involves one player leaving the other group with uh, boss killing gear so you can kill the boss easier. Also, if you don't know, I'm hosting a giveaway, so subscribe and watch um, the other giveaway videos I've made to enter the giveaway. And also, don't fall for impersonators and imposters of me. Um, if you click my profile, you can see that my actual name is xspitz, it's simple, and I'm level 139 in the game. So don't fall for people like these guys. Um, they're not me, and if someone named Spitz is asking something from you, then that's not me. I don't ask something of anyone, usually. So first of all, uh, one person uses maneuver gear, a better trait for damage, or like executioner, and then also an accelerator pet for that instant um, cooldown reduction. Um, we clear the cave and then uh, that person rushes to the boss and that's the only person who actually uses the fourth ability to kill the boss So I can kill the boss really easily here and then I can continue the speed run like normally The reason we can do this is because we can actually with two players clear every single area uh, Before the first boss with uh, assists and ultimates and everything so a third person in a three run isn't needed so that person can actually just rush to the boss so we can kill the boss a lot quicker. The problem with using like Nezuko even though you kill the boss faster is that after that you aren't really available to help the other two teammates uh, after you've killed the boss because you need to also be able to help your teammates clear the next areas after the boss. And that's why I'm using Shadow Monarch to kill the boss, even though it's not the fastest way to kill it. Um, I can also help the other two teammates after killing the first boss. But I will show you a clip of where I'm using Nezuko instead of Shadow Monarch for killing the first boss. Um, straight up, I'm just rushing to the boss without helping my teammates at all. This way, we actually kill the boss really fast. But the problem is um, how I'm supposed to catch up with them later on. Because even if I were to just rush to the Remember boss, I'm not sure I would have enough time because how fast Shadow Monarch is. So instead of just running the whole dimension with Nezuko, I reset to Shadow Monarch again, but that's where the problem is, because resetting takes a long time and I'm still really far behind and it's hard for me to catch up to my teammates. And yes, a big plus with using this strategy is that the one person using the ODM and everything, uh, who's also using an accelerator pet, is that you actually get back the cooldown really fast because of how accelerator pet works. So you can actually use your abilities but then get them back really quickly as long as you have the energy. Yeah, this is probably the new meta for speedrunning if you're three players or more. To have one person be ready to kill the boss really fast. Uh, as long as all of you guys have good stats so you can actually clear the dimension really easily. 